Most of us know the importance of skin hydration, but why, you might be asking, should we make sure hair is also hydrated? Well, the same way your skin can become rough and dry with exposure to extreme weather, your hair can also take a beating from environmental aggressors. The goal should be to provide your skin and hair with enough nourishment that they stay hydrated all day. If you're keen to have the most hydrated skin and hair possible, add the following hair and skin hydration tips into your daily self-care routine to reap the benefits. Let's first start with hair hydration tips. 1. Deep condition regularly. Summer is a great time to up the hydration ante with a deep conditioning formula. Look for moisturizing ingredients like avocado, olive, and almond oil that will add some natural shine. Even further ingredients such as shea butter, aloe vera, or glycerin are also known to be moisturizing. Incorporate your formula of choice into your routine at least once a week. 2. Use a moisturizing shampoo. An easy way to add a boost of hydration to your hair is with a fortifying shampoo that's designed to add moisture to your hair. Shampoos that contain natural oils help to effectively nourish your scalp, lengths, and tips for hair that becomes stronger and looks healthy with every wash. 3. Avoid hot styling tools. Your hair is already exposed to a significant amount of heat during the summer, so why add more? Excess heat can strip your hair of its natural oils and lead to dryness. To help maintain moisture, give the blow dryer, straightening iron, and curling iron a break. Instead, opt for a natural air dry with the help of an anti-frizz cream, which disciplines frizz without heat for an effortlessly smooth, undone style. 4. Brush carefully. Brushing your hair can help distribute moisture along the entire hair strand, so long as you follow the proper method. Use a large, round brush to gently detangle your hair. If your hair is really dry and frizzy, use a detangling spray and a wide-tooth comb to help minimize breakage and damage. Keep in mind that hair is fragile when it's wet. Avoid brushing your hair immediately after a shower or a swim. 5. Cover up. Unlike your skin, there is no sunscreen out there that can help protect your hair from damage caused by sun exposure. But that doesn't mean you have to avoid the sun altogether. Ahead of a long day outdoors, wrap your hair up in a hat, scarf, or chic turban. Before going for a swim, put on a swim cap to protect your hair from UV rays and chlorine. 6. Drink water. Dehydration will not do your body any favors. Stay hydrated from the inside out by drinking the recommended amount of water per day. 7. Use a leave-in conditioner. A great way to ramp up the hydration is to enlist the help of a leave-in conditioner. This offering helps to provide hair with long-lasting hydration which is just what your dehydrated strands need. A deep conditioner, whether homemade or shop-bought, comes right in handy to hydrate and nourish hair in only one use. 8. Avoid hot showers. Hot water is a great way to wind down after a long day, but it isn't the answer to how to hydrate hair. Super Hot H2O can easily strip your hair of its natural oils, leaving you with drier hair, which, while different from dehydration, isn't what your hair needs. Switching to lukewarm water will be a real lifesaver for your strands. 9. Protect your hair at night. One of the worst things you can do when dealing with dehydrated hair is not to protect your locks at night. You may not be aware, but sleeping on cotton sheets and pillowcases can also remove moisture from your hair. Cotton is a pretty absorbent material, so stay ahead of the game and cover your strands with a silk scarf or sleep on silk sheets and pillowcases to protect your mane as you get some shut-eye. 10. Use a hydrating hair mask. One of the best products for dehydrated hair is a hydrating hair mask. Imagine it as an amped-up leave-in conditioner designed to add maximum moisture and shine to your hair. A few times a week, swap your conditioner for a mask that can help hydrate your strands. Leave it on as directed, making sure not to wash it out too quickly so you can reap all the benefits. 11. Oil your scalp. Your natural hair needs oil, a reasonable quantity of it, to properly moisturize your hair. If you have a super oily scalp, you should probably skip this part. But if you produce a very little quantity of sebum, then you may need to add an extra bit of oil to your scalp. You can do this by using some natural oils like coconut oil, olive oil, or castor oil. Now let's move on to skin hydration tips. These apply to your face and your body. 1. Use a moisturizer with hydrating ingredients. 
Whether you've got dry skin, oily skin, sensitive skin, combination skin, or normal skin, it's essential to pick a moisturizer with hydrating ingredients. Look for one that's formulated with hyaluronic acid, which is known for its hydrating qualities. Or you can make your own moisturizer out of ingredients like oats, honey, and coconut oil. 2. Try water-based skincare products. Speaking of moisturizers, another option is using a water-based formula. Applying a water-based moisturizer helps your skin lock in moisture and replenish nutrients. And since water doesn't stick to the skin like oil does, it prevents it from filling pores and causing breakouts. You can make your own water-based moisturizer using aloe vera gel. 3. Apply moisturizer to damp skin. So you've either bought or made a moisturizer. Now how do you apply it? It's best to slather on your moisturizer when your skin is damp and help lock in hydration. The same rule applies to your body when you're applying lotion too. 4. Think beyond moisturizer. If your skin is craving more hydration, it might need a little extra something. Look for hydrating serums to take things up a notch. Generally, serums are applied after cleansing but before moisturizing and can be used day and night. Some serums have the added benefit of plumping skin and reducing the appearance of wrinkles for a more youthful appearance. 5. Use a pampering face mask. Speaking of getting more hydration, face masks make it oh so easy. Not only are face masks a great treat for your skin, the right mask can help provide your skin with long-lasting hydration and a myriad of other benefits. 6. Use an eye cream. While you may think that eye creams are reserved for mature skin, think again. The truth is, just as the skin on your face can lose moisture, so can the skin around your eyes. In fact, the skin around your eyes is the most fragile and thin skin on your body, so you need to give it extra TLC. 7. Skip long, steamy showers. A toasty shower feels incredible, especially when it's freezing outside. But long, hot showers can actually strip your skin of moisture, leaving you feeling dry. Instead, rinse off in lukewarm water and apply moisturizer when your skin is still wet post-shower. Your skin will thank you. 8. Invest in a humidifier. This is especially a good idea in the winter, but it can be of benefit year-round if you live in a dry climate. Low moisture and air can cause your skin to feel dry. That's where a humidifier comes in. It can help to add moisture back into the air and help your skin retain hydration. 9. Don't forget your hands and feet. You spend all that time on your face, but what about your hands and feet? Show them some TLC too. Try this trick. Before you hop into bed, smooth on a moisturizing cream, then slip on a pair of gloves and socks. When your alarm goes off in the morning, you'll be saying hello to softer, more hydrated hands and feet. 10. Drink enough water. The first step to hydrating your skin is hydrating your body. It is recommended for you to drink at least 8 glasses of water every day. Your body may require more, depending on your daily activities and weight. 11. Sunscreen is a must. Apply a broad-spectrum sunscreen to prevent UVA and UVB skin damage every time you step out in the day. Sun exposure can dehydrate your skin, causing it to lose moisture and break down its collagen and elastin, which are responsible for its strength and elasticity. This can cause premature signs of aging. 12. Eat foods rich in water. Fruits and veggies are not only hydrating but are beneficial for your skin in many other ways. Citrus-based fruits like oranges and lemons are packed with juice and are rich in vitamin C, which is vital for maintaining your skin's texture. Foods rich in vitamin A and B3 are also essential for improving your overall skin health. You've probably noticed some similarities between hydrating your skin and your hair, and you'd be right. Though some methods of hydration involve actually targeting the area you're looking to treat, a lot of it comes down to the foods you eat and the way you treat your body on the whole. It's much easier than you think to have healthy, hydrated skin and hair all year round. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please subscribe to this YouTube channel. And don't forget to give this video the thumbs up. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy this next video on 17 Incredible Benefits of Tea Tree Oil for Hair, Skin, and Beauty Uses. Thanks for watching, and bye for now.